In this tutorial, you learn how to create and assemble these plates in FreeCAD by using the Part Design, Assembly and Fasteners Workbench. Also, real threads will be covered. Let's create the first plate with the threads. Select the Part Design Workbench and create a new sketch. Then click on the XY plane. Select the Centered Rectangle tool. Click on the origin and drag the mouse. Enter 50 mm for the horizontal distance and 20 for the vertical distance. Click on Close to exit the sketch. Select Pad to extrude the rectangle. Leave it at 10 mm and click on OK. Now select the top face and create a new sketch for the hole. Select the circle tool and draw it on the origin. You don't have to add a diameter here, that will be done later. Click on Close to exit the sketch. Select the Hole feature. And choose an isometric regular profile. Choose M6 for the size. And select Through All for the depth. Check the Threaded and the Model Thread boxes. Check Update Thread View to show real threads instantly. Click on OK to apply. Now save the part so that you can use it in the assembly later. The first part is finished, now create a new document. Create a new sketch and select the XI plane. Draw the same rectangle of 50 by 20 millimeters on the origin again. Now create a circle on the origin, which will be the hole without thread. Enter a diameter of 8 mm. Click on Close to exit the sketch. Select Pad to extrude the rectangle with a hole. Enter a length of 5 mm and click on OK. The second part is finished. Don't forget to save it. Now create another new document for the assembly and save it. Consider subscribing if you like my content. Thanks. Select the Assembly Workbench. First click on the Create Assembly button. Then click on the Insert Component button. Click on the bodies of the two parts you just created to insert them. The first part must be grounded to continue assembling. Click on OK to apply. The thick part is grounded and a lock icon is displayed. You can drag the other part by holding the ALT key and the left mouse button. Now you can start to assemble both parts. Select this edge of the threaded hole. Hold the control key and select this edge, which is the hole of the other plate. Then create a fixed joint by clicking this button. Enter a rotation of 90 degrees. The plates will be perpendicular to each other. You can also enter an offset, but you can leave it at zero now. Click on OK to apply. Now select the fasteners workbench. When it's not installed, you can do so by using the add-on manager. Click on the edge of the upper hole, the one without thread, and select this washer, which will be added to the selected edge. Select it and change the size to M6. Now select the edge of the washer and add this screw. The size is correct, but the length needs to be changed. 
First, hide all joints by clicking the eye icon next to it. Then select the screw and change the length to 16mm to make it longer. Select the part design workbench and look at the bottom side. Hide the screw and the washer by clicking the eye icons next to them. Now you see how both holes are connected to each other. Click the eye icons again to show the fasteners. So this is how basic assembling works in FreeCAD. You might also want to check out my 3D printing channel. See you there.